What's up, everyone, and welcome to another episode of Randy.com's Garage Sale Transformers Toy Finders, or GSTF2 for short. It's a new show, and today we are also doing Garage Sale Toy Find Season 11.5. It's episode number 23, and this is the show where we try to answer the question, is it difficult to transform? Today we're taking a look at this guy, which is obviously Transformers Generation, Classics, the Universe, maybe Classics. Deluxe Class, Sideswipe. So, of course, we do have Siege already, we have... Um, I forgot if it's War for Cybertron or Fall of Cybertron Sideswipe we have, we have, who else do we have? Um, I think we have a KO Passive Sideswipe, but we have to look at that. What else, what other Sideswipe do we have? We have Sideswipe Transformers Prime, we don't have, uh, what else? We don't have one Sideswipe, robots in this guy's Sideswipe, too bad. But anyway, let's try to transform this, this is our second uh, for this mold, um, we have Red Alert already, so it's pretty. It'll be pretty cool to have them all together. Oh my gosh! It looks like this guy's missing something. I'm not liking that. Oh boy! I am not liking that. Oh, hopefully, it doesn't look like he's complete. That's too bad. But oh, no wonder why. I, I think I got this guy for real cheap. Um, at, on the next episode, I'm gonna take a look at Sunstreaker, and that guy's. I think it's complete. And I got them together for cheap because this guy's incomplete. So let's just okay, try to transform this guy. Uh, yeah, I, I think I've posted him enough, but I haven't taken a photo. So I'll take a photo right there. And then let's try to transform him. So obviously this is the back of the car. His feet are going to hide in there somehow. Somewhere, maybe like that. Okay, it will fold. Oh. Maybe that's not how it is, but I don't know how it is actually. Let's pull his feet out again a little tiny bit. So this is going to go like that. And you can already see... Oh, he's gonna rotate at the waist, well, most likely. I, I, I. So it's been a while since I last looked at Red Alert. Okay, there you go. So I, I do remember there's like a... Um, yeah, slide here. Basically, you have to slide something in and out or something. Was it this mold? I don't. I really don't remember now. But um, okay. Guess it's just going to be like that. Okay. These are going to. This is going to be on the back. And like so. Like so. We're already halfway there. And then this is supposed to have. Oh boy. Oh, it was supposed to rotate, I suppose, but it's not happening anymore. Something has to push down. There you go. Just push down. Oh, okay, okay. When I push down the head, that thing rotates. Pretty cool. Okay. Um, oh, I guess these are supposed to hide in here somehow. Okay, there you go. It's a little better. Like so. Okay, it hides all the way in there. It's, again, it's been a while. I've done this for a red alert, but it's been a while, so I don't know. And then push that in as well. Somehow that's going to be in there. So, um, yeah. And obviously the thingies are going to... Oh, how does... How do I... Oh, maybe it's the wrong way. Okay, it's gonna go like that. I think. I can't rotate it. What's going on here? Am I missing a step? Oh, there you go. I have to do that first. Uh, okay, the white part goes up, red shoulder part goes down, and then they're just gonna go around and rotate and just. So many hinges and pivot joints in a row. It's gonna be something like that. This rotates around as well. Oh wow. Oh wow. I mean, oh please. <laughs> I don't want to have to deal with this, but it is what it is. How do I get that around? Oh, there you go. Oh, okay. If this thing also rotates. Wow. That's just too many steps, I think. Again, too many. Let's call it hinges and joints and series uh, I mean I, I guess that's realistic 
you bisexuals, sorry, excuse that term, are looking for that. Um, yeah, but this is still the boxy type. Okay, you know what aliens are supposed to look like. Okay, oh boy, almost there, almost there. So it's a good thing I, I looked at this for my... Is it episode 23? Yeah, 23 and then 24 is gonna be Sunstreaker. Lambrose! Oh boy, what's going on here? Ooh. It's just a matter of alignment, I think. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh, there you go. I just pushed it all in together. And there it is. So even without the top part, it looks so nice. I mean, what? what can't go wrong with a Lamborghini. Or a lamp, full Lamborghini. And, and look at that. Oh wow, so flat. Wow, you transformed it very well. Can't believe it. So that took about, what, a little over six minutes. Let's say seven minutes. It's not the easiest. Man, but that's a really nice toy really nice car let's try transforming now back into oh wow let's just look at that let's transform him back into robot mode shouldn't be very difficult okay pop this out uh pro probably disconnect the legs just so it is also easier to disconnect from the doors there you go and we're just going to pop those out so it's a little easier just to blow everything up pretty much and then we're gonna do that, do that, and do that, and do that, do that, do that. That's gonna be the front of our. Oh, but this one's going here, I suppose. And we're gonna have to get the feet out of there somehow. There you go. That's. It's just so many steps. I mean, but it's probably just one step too many. But I mean, it's not too bad. Okay, he's almost there. And then we're just gonna drop down, spin around his arms. And then we are just gonna drop his. Um, actually, let's. Oops. Let's pop out his head. Spinning this. Oh, that way. Okay. Precision in the way. Somehow, I don't know how this is supposed to work. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. Whoa. What's going on here? Oh, there you go. It extends up further. Makes it a whole lot easier to drop down. There you go. Um, okay, just position the arms properly, shoulders particularly. I wonder if this was supposed to be in there, but maybe not. And last but not least, let's display the head. There it is. And just going to, I don't know if the, oh, I'll just leave it there. And then just position the fists like that. Position this, maybe do a little bit of a spin. Okay, not bad. To the side, and a little bit of a spin. And that is it. Side swipe. Very nice figure. I mean, I think this is classics. <laughs> uh, you'll, you'll find it in the title, but I mean, it deserves to be called a classic, man. Um, this is pretty good. This is the first time they sort of tried to modernize G1. Um, it, it is very cool. Between this and the Warp, the Siege one, I it's a little bit of a toss-up. It's unfortunate that the Siege one is short, but eh, it is what it is. Uh, this one, it's just a little complicated, but it's not bad actually. Uh, robot mode is, uh, you can see it there. It's not, it's not my ideal proportions, but it's not bad as well. But uh, yeah, that being said, that is about it for this episode of Ronzi.com's Garage Sale Transforms Toy Finders, or GSTF2 for short. It's a new show. Once again, this is also Garage Sale Toy Find Season 11.5. It's the rest of our pre-holiday 2019 haul uh, special series, and this is episode number 23. Classics Sideswipe, Deluxe Class Sideswipe. 
We hope you liked this episode, and if you did, don't forget to hit like, comment, and subscribe. Also, please follow us on our social media channels. We're on Patreon, Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Last but not least, please share this video with your friends, your family, your loved ones, and everybody you know, including your enemies, because they might start to like you again, as Alphonsus Prime would say. And until next time, Autobots, rev up and rule out.